So someone asked me about Mark Sisson and testosterone slow twitch article. I said Mark Sisson recommends testosterone. First one up, training is no guarantee of health. I agree. So this is Mark Sisson. Now Mark Sisson, I'm assuming this is the Mark Sisson, the primal diet guy. I used to work for the World Anti-Doping Agency in USADA. So anti-doping plan. Now, so Mark Sisson is the architect of Triathlon's anti-doping plan. Mark's Daily Apple. Now, that's a picture of Mark Sisson there. So, I'm assuming this is Mark Sisson. <laughs> I mean, it says it is, but we'll go down. So, we talk a bit, talking about training and stuff there, glycogen. But what the question I've been asked a lot of is Mark Sisson says that he's giving advice for triathletes, and he says, I would incorporate therapeutic amounts of testosterone. Yes, I know it's illegal, but I'm giving the best case scenario to balance out the high levels of cortisol when I have gone to the world too much. Does that mean Mark Sisson takes testosterone himself? I don't know. I, I don't know. And anyway, so he says uh, down here, he talks about Floyd Landis, and he says, I believe Floyd Landis did not take testosterone. We all, we all know Floyd did, and Floyd even admits it, and he got busted for it, so... Doesn't make him a bad person, but that's just the truth there. So I always find it amusing when Mark Sisson talks about you know, how he's worked for the World Anti-Doping Agency, then he's promoting testosterone usage, and he says, I would take testosterone if I got too stressed and stuff like that. So a lot of people ask me, how come Mark Sisson has got such big muscles for an old guy? <laughs> well, I think... I think we have the answer. Ladies and gentlemen, post your comments and thoughts down below. Should you take synthetic testosterone, even though it's illegal? Personally, I'll say no. I'll say no to drugs. Mark Sisson promotes the drug usage by the judgment of this article. What do you think? Share your comments down below. Interesting stuff.